So I guess the question is, so what is the most effective textbook or materials I can use for the preparation for my physics, chemistry, biology, math, English, my UTME examination? All right, we're going to be talking about high yield materials and recommended textbooks you can use. For me, all right, if you want to get the phone from YouTube, from Jam, you can go to Jam Bible. I'm going to be making a short video on that. All right, chemistry. Let's start with chemistry first, my favorite. All right, so chemistry, I use new school chemistry a lot. I use new school chemistry a lot, actually. And this gives my formative knowledge of chemistry. Although it didn't help me so much in the calculation aspect, I was as confused as a bat when it came to me using new school chemistry for calculation. I had to probably buy one or two calculation test books on chemistry. I've forgotten their name. But if you find anyone that is helpful, I bought one by written by my teacher, yes, Mr. Amos, on chemistry, right? On chemistry calculations. So I read it and I digested it. The book that helped me in chemistry was Lambda. Lambda helped my life. Hands up. <laughs> he helped my life. So, Lambda series, they really, I think it was written by some professors in the Obama family all the way in the I think so. It really helped me a lot. It helped me in terms of, you know, getting myself familiarized with questions. So, Lambda helped me a lot. And also in terms of organic chemistry, I, did, I learned a lot when it came to in organic chemistry from Lambda. And the Jam Remix series, the Jam Remix series did help me a lot. I was able to solve as many questions as possible using the Jam Remix past question. And I think most of the answers are actually kind of correct. I think so. I think probably 80%. So it really helped me a lot. And I really like the fact that the questions were arranged topically. Okay, so okay. Alright, so one textbook that I feel like would have helped me a lot but I did not use was all in PC physics. All inclusive is very good for calculations in physics. All right, use it, use it, use it, use it very well. What is good? I don't still understand <laughs> the science physics. I get many people use that textbook a lot, but ah, I don't understand. That textbook it looks like A level to me, so I did not use it actually. I use new school. New school products were my like my my OGs, my my friends. I use new school physics also. They formed my formative years of me learning physics. All right, so lambda physics I use a lot to acclimatize myself. So to familiarize myself with past questions and with questions in general and with concept short key points lambda has this kind of summary note so you can use lambda series for your summary note also all right the remiss past questions also did help me but what really helped me for physics was the past the remiss past questions i solved and solved, solved a lot and I think another thing that helped me was i had a good teacher mr adam sadibuha was my physics teacher so my biology lambda biology helped me a lot i was able to solve all the questions on both my lambda biology and my jam series so these are the things that helped me you can find other people telling you that these other things help them. You can try to check them out. But the textbook I recommend for biology is modern biology. <laughs> ah, you know I'm laughing right now. Because some people watching this video right now are using the particular textbook called Essential. Ah, I don't have any beef with the textbook, but come on. If you want to up your game, use a better textbook. Alright, so essentially, I think that's very good for why, but for them, due to my own experience, I'd like you to use modern biology. The only biology is bulky, you, but you will gain what you are meant to gain. I'm, I'm not sure that there's any question that I'll say that you won't find in modern biology. Another textbook is college biology. It's college biology very well. Oh, please, don't forget modern. Please. I'm begging you. No, I'm begging you now. For English. English! Mm, deep. English. You now I've made a video on English and why people don't get 90 in their English or very good high school and why or how you can do it. Alright, so take your, your jam novel seriously, like you're a headmaster or whatever novel you are using by the time you are watching this, take it very seriously. And one textbook that helped my life, hands up, Jam A to Z. Hey! Another one is Fundamentals of English, I guess. Those two textbooks, they are green, like the two of them are green. Yeah, on Invisible Teacher, I think the same person that wrote Invisible Teacher was the same person that wrote Jam A to Z. I think just like a revised person. So those three, hey, use it. I'm begging you. And your jump ask questions. Solve as many questions, synonyms, antonyms. But should be told, the synonyms you might see in your past questions, you might never see any one of them in your jump. So learn more synonyms outside your your jam past question. And one textbook I advise is Dandy Use of English. That textbook is good. So for many questions, for a lot of questions, that textbook is very good. I've told you the textbooks now, so don't say I did not tell you. For maths, mm, math student. What can I say? Lamna, use your lamna. Lamna is very helpful. And if you if you look for math, you can just help me in the comment section. But I don't really know a lot. But you can help me in the comment section. So for math, use lamna. I, I know that lamna is very good, all right? All the lamnas are good. And oh, I'll write my own textbook very soon. I also serve as a very high yield material for preparation for the examination. You found you, yeah, what I know you found value in this video. So 
please like, subscribe. I have a goal of reaching a thousand subscribers before the end of my Please, I'm begging. Thank you so much. And just hit the subscribe button. Just there. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. And bye.